Today, 14 May 2016, five years today. Uh, I got a Panasonic uh, Sophia, a road find, of course. Uh, it got purity issues. And I just was always curious um, how it would perform. So I've got a normal video playing here at the moment, and that's fine. And this morning, nice. while I was in the pool, I was in the swimming nice. pool, I thought, hey, Let's try a TV on DC. Technically, a TV is a DC device. Nice, little guy forks. You rectify the mains up from uh, 240, oh. 230 volts to a DC well. So, I've set up my two battery chargers which I got here. 210 volts, but I boosted them up to 125. So we're gonna get 125 plus 125 is 250 DC. And we're gonna plug this TV in on the DC socket which I made up. So we got this one. And these two devices have been series stop. So I got the outputs as you can see here, the DC out here, plus minus, and then a jumper, a grey jumper to the other one. So these are both rated at uh, oh, about two and a half ampere. They're obsolete equipment, and uh, for me to play with. So uh, I'll show you the voltage on the multimeter. So I'm going to use this socket here. And I plug the TV in there shortly, so I'll just show, give you a voltage reading. I'll just put the camera down, stand by. Okay, I hope you can see it. Meter on DC. And with a bit of luck, we'll get a reading here of about 250. Oh, 260 volts is even better. 260 volts DC. So I'm going to plug the device in shortly. And here we've got the totalizer of the workshop. We've got this video playing. Let's de energize the TV, plug it in, and uh, let's see what happens. De energize the TV. Okay, plug the TV in the DC socket. TV is switched off. Now we're going to energize the TV and see what happens. So the TV is on the VCR. It is playing. I hope it's. Uh, hang on. VCR turns itself off. Okay, we'll turn the TV on on DC and what happens. Drawing half an ampere. And the flipping TV works on DC. Got a DC operated TV here. Believe you me, it's amazing. Makes sense, it should work. It looks like heaven. I'll show you the reading on the M meters here. Oh, we got 130 volts around here and we got about 0.4 ampere. And we got the same here and we got about 0.4.5. And I'll get the meter on here shortly. I'll see if I can do this. No, I need to put the camera down. Stand by. Okay, I'll test. Uh, it's still on DC. I'll stop a little bit. 254. Well, we'll it works. So I'm going to do an experiment now. I'm going to turn one of the charges off and see if the TV still maintains uh, a reading or still working. I'll zoom this out a little bit. It's a uh, 120 volts. Hang on, camera needs to go further back a bit. And I'll try to lower this down a bit. I just don't want to cut in the video too much. So, see if it works on 110 volts DC. Oh, 125, somewhere around there. So, I'll de energize one of the chargers. The TV runs now at 130 volts and it still works. That's cool, let the microwave smoke itself out. So we've got a 110 volt DC TV, and if you look at the ammeter, the current has gone up to 1 ampere. And it still goes series through that ammeter there, because they're both in series, but uh, that is de-energized. Okay, I'll put the camera back up and we'll... Uh, shit, that surprises me actually. I thought there will be an AC component in a TV set, which needs AC for references or whatever. So that's still cooking away there. 
I'm going to turn the other charger back on. I'll keep this on the TV, see if there's any difference in brightness. Energized charger too. So the TV is very smooth. Sofia Panasonic, it's quite amazing. Let this uh, transformer burn itself out quickly, see what happens. Just for the entertainment value. Oh, there we go, there we go. Relocate the camera a little bit. Oh dear, I'm playing around again with the other camera. A Minecraft transformer on the TV. So pleasing. Oh, so amazing. I'm going to turn this other this charger off and we'll see how the meters behave. De energize, voltage stop, the current goes up, which makes sense as the switch mode power supply on the TV needs to compensate for the lower voltage. So the TV runs now at 130. I'll get a digital voltmeter on there. Hang on, I'll need to send myself back up on a tripod. So 125 volts on the TV. I'm gonna ramp it down a bit, uh, see how that works, because I've got an adjuster on these chargers. So um, hang on, I need to get these uh, terminals in here. Yeah, that's right. I'll put it on here. This one is still charged. Just ramping it down, and then we'll see what happens. I've got an adjuster here. Come on, you bitch, go. Fuck yeah, beauty. That doesn't want to go much slower than 125. Forget that one. TV back on 125 DC and we'll double the voltage instantly and we're up to 270 or 253 and the TV has no problems so is it? Brilliant. <laughs> this is the rear of these two battery chargers, plug trickle chargers, very good devices, made in New Zealand by Santon. And the name plate quotes 230 volt 50 hertz. Nothing about DC.